Hi, Neil here with Covers and Camel, your source for custom seat covers, talking to you today about how to care for your custom seat covers. Today, the fabric that we're talking about is the simulated leather material. T today, we have the black ostrich to show you this on. And so if you're cleaning up your black ostrich material or any of the simulated leathers, really there's a couple steps that you can do. The first step, easiest step, is just gonna take some water, spray it on, spray on the water on there, and you know, you could use you know a bucket to spray this water on, dip it in a rag, or just you use a water bottle like this, kinda get it wet like that. And then what you'll do is take a, a cloth, I like using a microfiber cloth, and you'll just, just wipe these down like that, okay? So you just wipe that simulated leather, that vinyl down, and wipes off nice and easy like that. You can, again, you could use a little bit of soap. I, I could drop a few drops of uh, dish soap in this and get a little soapy if you wanna get that, you know, if it's a little bit harder stain to, to get out, you can clean it up like that, okay? Now, the next things that you wanna do with these vinyls every now and then, if you wanna try to keep them uh, nice, and, nice and smooth and, and soft, is you could use a, a vinyl cleaner. And I have a vinyl cleaner that we'll grab here and then also a vinyl conditioner that you could use, uh, a leather vinyl conditioner to kinda get these a little bit softer and make sure that, especially if you live, some, live somewhere that it's really cold, and the cold vinyl can get kind of hard and this will help them to stay nice and soft and, and prevent prevent cracking. So first thing I'm gonna do is grab a vinyl uh, cleaner. So this is a, a vinyl or, or vinyl and leather cleaner and what I'll do is I'll actually just spray onto the microfiber cloth here. And then what I'll do is just kind of clean that up. If, and that's again, if you need to clean up uh, if, if you're finding that you want to get a little bit of a deeper vinyl clean, uh, get a little bit of a deeper clean to the, to the simulated leather or, or vinyl here. So you can wipe it down with that, okay? And that'll dry off here in a second. But then, now again, this is just a few extra steps that you could do. Most likely that soap and water is, is gonna do most of the cleaning that you need. But if you want to kind of go a few extra steps to care for this simulated leather, this is the, the way to go. Okay, so again, this is the cleaner here. And once you've rubbed that on there, you can kind of get that all spread around there. Next step is gonna be taking a conditioner. So here is a uh, vinyl and leather conditioner that we're gonna use. And this, this actually gives it a nice, and we're just gonna put a little bit of the conditioner on like this, just kind of a dressing conditioner. And this right here is gonna give it, it's re I really like using it because it makes this ostrich just really pop out and gives it kind of a nice gloss uh, there while, especially for photos as we're taking photos and getting it dressed up and looking nice. Now, this is a conditioner, so once you get this on here, you're gonna wanna let it just sit for uh, overnight, so about 24 hours. Just let it sit there for a day, or, and just let this kinda dry on there. And so we're gonna get this rubbed on there. And again, this is just a great way to make sure that your simulated leather is staying clean, it's staying nice and soft, and you're taking care of it there. It's a real durable simulated leather anyhow, but this is another Another couple steps of how to just uh, treat this and really make sure it stays nice and smooth and soft for you. Okay, so we're just rubbing this in. Now again, this is, we're only gonna be using this conditioner on the simulated leather material, okay? Now this would, this would be fine too if, on the original seats on this Can-Am Defender. If you don't even have the seat covers and you wanna use this on your vinyl seats, you'd be fine using this there as well. Uh, but we're using it on the seat covers here to, you can kinda of see how right now it gives it kind of a nice gloss right there. It's kind of a nice nice look while it's, it's a little bit wet on there still. Okay, so you just rub that in and 
then you, again, you're just gonna let that dry. And that is really the last step that you need to do to really care for that simulated leather. Again, main step is at first just soap and water to get the dirt and grime off of your, your covers. But if you wanna go those extra steps with a vinyl cleaner and a conditioner, that's a good step too to do as well and just keep it nice and soft and, and supple for you. Thanks so much for watching. Again, this has been Neil here with Covers and Camel, your source for custom seat covers, showing you how to care for your seat covers. If you wanna see more, go to coversandcamel.com. Thanks.